going on everybody welcome back to total war league siege season eight today's group d battle is the first of the season between perkele and last season's champs the rice enjoyers perkele on the attack will bring macadon and rdi for a conservative two-point victory the rice enjoyers will field parthia and lusitani for a possible four-point victory of their own keep up to date with all league information stats and battle replays by following the links in the description welcome back to the grand city of Antioch. We're here again with another Group D. No? Yes, this is a Group D matchup between last season's champions, Rice and Joyers, and Perkele. They've grabbed themselves a new sub this season. The amazing man, the myth, the legend, fight me himself. Interesting tactic by the defenders, bringing a mostly full Sally. All of these Lusitani vet shield warriors up in the front, it's a little bit dangerous considering we've got RDI. They've got their artillery facing the gatehouse. Lots of javies, lots of missile fire, but the champions not to be underestimated. See what they brought to the field. We got some Sarmatians. We've got some Cataphracts, Royals, and Easterns. Slingers up on the walls. We got a Scorpion out the gate. Nice aggressive strategy from the defenders. Hopefully it will pay off. But the Scorpion's getting pummeled by the attacking artillery. Man, this battle just started and went in. No foreplay, no lube. Just right into it. Let's see how the defenders or how the attackers respond. Defenders getting close to the flank, looking for an opportunity. If they can keep them outside of the city. I mean, the battle's only 20 minutes, so someone is going to get stomped. They're just going to chill for a minute, make use of their ammo. Got to hold the flank here, but the aggressive defenders coming in for the charge. Doesn't look like the attackers were ready for this charge. Nice move by the Sarmatians. It's going to follow that up with some Cataphracts, but should absolutely crush this side. Then they're moving up the Iberian Swords as well. Very, very aggressive. Lots of Pila coming down, though. Lots of Missile Fire falling on this Cav. Only 11 kills, 25 kills, 13 kills. I think the Tort got in the way of this guy. This Sarmatian just kind of chilling, not doing too much. Gonna get some Iberian Swords and that's gonna hurt. Especially we get to get this charge off. Nice 20 bonus charge. Celtic Warriors, no counter charge. More Cav in. But it is getting lit up. These archers are having their way with it. Can they kill these guys fast enough to crumple the flank and roll it up? It's gonna be tough. And the attackers shifting over a whole bunch of infantry. Cav Gen, lots of archers. Easter Cataphracts are going to take some of that Pila and change their mind about what they're doing. Take some Pila to the butt cheeks on the way out, though. 63 on the Sarmatian, only 5 on the Cata. Iberian Swords getting also annihilated. I like the idea of putting the Slingers on the walls, but I think they're not far. They didn't wait for the attackers to get close enough. So these Slingers are kind of being ineffective. Um... I believe the slinger range is probably about there, maybe a little bit further. Yeah, maybe this far. They are 150. So the attackers, um, they get to kind of keep their units just outside of the range and piecemeal this defensive strategy into oblivion. Rock sort up to only 14 kills, 52 on the Illyrian Thoreos, but he's routing. Can they get... Ooh, he's going to take some shots to the back. That's less than ideal for the, for the defenders. we got some Eastern Cadas in the mix. 38 kills only. The defenders are going to have to pull this out a little bit. Kind of getting worked over on the flank there. What happened to the artillery? Eastern Scorpion, 35 kills. Two pieces left. Iberian Swords falling short on this aggressive maneuver. There's just too much peel up for these, for these lightly armored units. And too much peel up for these cataphracts to be taking it in the back. Yeah, save that, Jen. You're going to need him later. 16 minutes left. Balance of power. 
heavily in favor of the attackers. I mean, the Balearics, the Slingers are getting some kills. It's just not, they're not getting close enough to the walls for it to really be that effective. All right, let's see. Attackers are going to regroup. Try to push the walls, maybe get inside. So let's skip ahead briefly and get into that action. All right, the defenders, now that the attackers have repositioned themselves, getting ready to push, defenders are going to move up some more troops, threaten the other side this time. I mean, they, they can get those Kadas in the back lines here. That's going to be a problem. But they do still have a ton of Illyrian hoplites. Artillery just crushing on this uh, on this Scorpion unit. He's missing now, but he, he did some damage. He's going to keep trying. Oh, he's manually firing it over at, these, uh, at this little block. That's a good little spot. If you can get it. Hard flank. Let's see what they do. A lot of tower shots, inadvertent tower shots coming from this eastern slinger here. What's he trying to get at? He's just dumping on this thorax right now. And the return fire is also going to hit some of that. Um, hit some of those towers. 16 men lost by the slay slinger. Must have something to do with that scorpion over there. 50 kills now. Attacker's going to shift over hard to the other side, to this new flank that they've just opened up. That the defenders have just opened up. Slinger with only one kill. I think it might have been a slave slinger he was shooting at. Do they have a scorpion? Do the attackers have a scorpion? I don't think so. I think just the giant ballista. They're going to shift a bunch of stuff over. I need to get inside here. Illyrian Levy going to shift over to the far side, bringing all the missile units over. I mean, there's not much over here in terms of armored units. They need to let the attackers see. If the attackers do this, they can roll up the flank of the defenders. What they need to do is corral the attackers into this so that you can whoop, give them a little whoopsie. Give them a little around the side. All right, just setting it up, doing the dance. Oh, now we're taking some shots. All right, Swordman going to lose to that Balearic. A lot of units. He sees it and just keeps pushing it forward. Yep. That's a good angle. Here they come, coming for the walls. This is exactly what the defenders wanted. Get them close, get them in slinger range. Don't rush out yet. Don't rush out yet. Stay back. Bring this tight. Bring this tight. Don't rush out yet. No. Cause you got this concave here with the um with the towers you want to keep them in tower range linger range do all the damage veteran ship warrior is going to get in hard no counter charge from the thorax that's gonna hurt baby that's gonna hurt nice i love the veteran shield warrior so good if only they had some more armor this is a problem for you look at this maneuver that is a brilliant maneuver from macadon that shield's going to suffer greatly. Nice little cab charge. Knock them all down. Get in with the thorax. Throw a pila volley and then in. Look at that. Nasty. Completely crushed this veteran shield warrior. 121 kills. Oh, and over here as well, we got some gorilla warriors into these Thoreo spears. More gorilla warriors into these thorax. It's just too many pila not enough armor for a loose tiny sally in my opinion need to do something about the missile units before you take that frontline fight with these uh very low armored units oh they broke the thorax nice move good play oh look at this they've gone on the hard flank as well got really gorilla swords gonna get into these illyrian thoreos Throwing up that square. Nice charge. That should work out pretty well for the Gorilla Sword. And another Gorilla... Did I call it a Gorilla Sword? 
Gorilla Warrior. He's going to get into the side area Noble Hoplite, but they got that expert charge defense. It's going to be a tough game over here. They need to get this. You know, it would have been good is have, have a cavalry unit over here, too. Would have been really nice. Slave Slinger's taking some losses. Cav just kind of chilling, waiting for their opportunity. I like the move with the Balearics on the wall. I mean, they haven't got a ton of kills yet, but they're going to start racking them up. You know they're going to start racking them up as soon as the attackers get pushing those artillery, or pushing those um, siege equipment. I don't know why I call it artillery. It's siege equipment. Nice little pull away. Pulls away, gets a lot of Pila into this Gorilla Swords right in the butt cheeks. He's going to have to take on that Thorax. I mean, the Illyrian Noble... They're just disgusting. It's just a crazy defensive unit. You know, need to get get this closer, get some Pila into him. Break this unit. Maybe you can break this. Yeah, that's a great idea. Get this over here. Get this over here. And this one here. And just try to break those units as best you can. They're going to bring more things out. What else are they bringing out here? Iberian swords. What's in the front here? More Iberian swords. Artillery coming down somewhere. I missed that. I think he's shooting at the front gate here. He is shooting at the gate as they come out. Absolutely annihilating those units. Hard flank. Rumbling for the defenders. They gotta make a move with this unit. He's getting some peel off, but he is getting shot right hand side. Into the back of the hoplites, but is it gonna be enough to break it? I don't know. I've seen sword getting in. This is kinda of wild. There's a wild little sally, this one. Vet shields melting quickly. Melting very fast. Slinger's only at 10 kills. Where is the noble gen? They could easily, easily take this, break this, take this. Ah, eh, the slingers are right there. But again, they're fighting all the combat outside. Predominantly outside of the range of the slingers. So they're not getting the support they need. They're not getting the support they need for their heavy, heavy attack here. Turn that vet shield around. Save your slingers. That's going to be tough, though. I think Sword needs to turn and face. Protect this slinger boy. We got another Parthian up here. Only 59 kills. Noble hoplites. Kicking ass. Oh, and the aggressive push on the other side from the Iberians. The gen coming out, taking some stones to the face. Taking a few rocks to the face. Didn't seem to phase him, though. Oh, there he goes. Dropping seven men on the volley. Iberian Swords trying to sneak around into the back. I mean, it's not a bad play if you kill this. Get into some archers, maybe. You know, get into the ballista. Oh, here comes the camels. Or the eastern caddis. They're not camels. Nice charge. Ooh, good, good, good charge. Really well, blah, 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 really well done. Getting through, kind of hung up on that unit. Is there going to be a lot of shield wall, a lot of square formation? That's going to be tough to break through for these caddids. I don't think that's a wise idea. They, what they need to be doing is around this way, around this way, and, and busting up on this. There's not too much over here. They could easily bust up on this over here. I like this move. Making the attackers work for it. Get in there. You should be able to crush this. Pull this cattle up. Pull this cattle up. Pull this cataphrag out. Get him out. He's losing only 95 kills. No, 100 kills on this cattle. Why am I calling him a cattle? This, because I want to say camel cataphrag, but it's not. It's just an eastern cataphrag. It's just an eastern cataphrag. Get him out of there. Now the gen's about to get absolutely annihilated. It's looking really not great for the defenders. Do they have anything inside? I think it's all slingers, and that is it that's left. Nothing else. 75 kills, 95 kills, 110, 40, 0. The general's getting shot in the back now, too. Oh, no, never take an engagement unless you want to stay there. That's so rough. Only 29 kills on the general. Gonna cycle up with the vet shields. Very nice little cycle charge. Illyrian Levy's at 50. Rayo Spears at 42. Getting some camel cataphracts in the back line. Is he gonna make it clear? He's going to get clear, but the Cavgen's coming over to 
put an end to this. Is he finally... No, he hit something. Hit something! He's trying to hit the back of this. Illyrian to break it to get and flood the rest of that infantry, the last little bit of their infantry in. But I don't think it's going to be enough. The entire defense fought outside the walls. 130 on the Scorpion, pretty good. Getting to get that gen in the mix. Five minutes left in the battle, so they must have something else in the tank here. Yeah, this is a good little move. Sandwich this guy. Oh, that's a nice hit. They just erased him. Disappeared. There it goes. Wow. All right. What do we got here? Balerics with only 22 kills. 132. That's really good. You gotta, you gotta make the most of those Balerics, though. That's for dang sure. This is a tiny noble. Vest shield warriors holding back the hordes of attackers at the moment. I think the Eastern Scorps had ammo. They're just gonna, they gotta get closer. So, yeah, they needed to get closer. They need to pull those guys into the range of their towers and into the range of their Balerics, the Balerics on the wall. That would have been a huge, huge help. Camel's 125 of 69 on this Cataphrac. Is he gonna go in? I say hit this. Try to keep them away so you can keep getting these shots off. They did not annihilate this. I thought he would die. I'm surprised that Thorax uh, is still surviving, man. That shield are 160. That's pretty damn good. But that's going to be... I'm going to call game here. I don't think the defenders are going to be able to turn this around. I know there's three minutes, almost four minutes left in the battle. But what else, what else could they possibly have that we don't see that could turn this? With all that noble infantry. Go on, Jen. Go on, Jen. Get it done. He's going to flee. That's actually not bad. These guys are going to get a lot of shots in their back as they run away. Nice little... Oh, almost dodged it. Almost got away from that uh, Cretan. Not quite. All the way back to the walls. Turn and fire. Auto fire. I'm not sure why they came out, honestly. I'm a little bit stumped on uh on that the walls are your friend when you're the missile you get the vantage point for the height the protection from infantry they can't just rush you like this here comes the cavalry oh they do have some more inside it's hillman that's gonna save the day intercept the gen maybe they kill the gen that could help that'd be huge oh they caught the cataphrag oh my goodness oh they still have one oh wow that seemed like a bit of a throwaway for those slingers. 73 kills. They didn't even get all their ammo off for sure. They barely used it at the beginning. Kind of a toss. Kind of a toss. A little bit shame. A little bit. Ooh, the cataphract wrecking up kills. Yeah, always wise to uh, try to protect your ammo. I think that's the way to go. You definitely want to protect the ammo. This slinger's just going to charge the line of Cretans. He says... I've had enough of this business. You're getting in tight. You're getting in close. Hillman getting into the archers. Very nice. But again, Iberian Slingers getting completely annihilated. The Cav Gen. He's on the way out. Hillman in here to turn the tide of the battle. I mean, they've done a lot of damage. There's a lot of dead bodies out here. It's a good, a good attempt, valiant effort by the defenders. It's what do they say? Uh, what do they say often in sports? It's a good defense, but better offense. The attackers were ready. They knew how to react. They knew what to do with the sally, and they made the defenders pay. Hillman thirty-five kills. Hillman at zero kills. Another part. Oh, they got another Parthian sword. Okay. He's going to get into the mix. Rack, yo, look at those kills on this guy. 145 and counting. Very, very nice. Unfortunately, it's going to be not enough. And these units are going to route fairly quickly. All in all, GG's, everybody. The champ's coming in. Trying something new. 
not quite working out uh, for Kelly. Solid team. Possible favorite to win it all this season. And by the looks of it, they have a good chance. Excellent teamwork. I, they might have to still break the wall to get in because... Yeah, the Slingers are still holding. Oh, they got 10 seconds. They're going to have army losses here right away. That's going to be it. Yeah, that's the end. GG's and glory to all the fighters. Let's have a look at these kills. Starting with Bite Me, the famous YouTuber. Link in the description. Great archer kills. Very nice. Very good mid tier. I mean, they got they kind of got sallied on a little bit and hit with those uh, cataphracts. So some of them suffered, but overall a decent. Jen also kind of got melted, but still 105 kills. Not too shabby. Uh, we've got Hagai. He didn't have to do much, honestly. Um, so, you know, good kills for him as well. Nice use of the hoplites. Illyrian Levy with 122, really good. Uh, Illyrian Thoreos, they kind of got stomped on by the Cav too, but still pretty decent kills. And he had a bunch left over. Now let's turn to the champs. Nice Rice bringing that uh, huge amount of cavalry. Couple of slingers. Uh, unfortunately, one of them definitely routed. Trying to hold them off the walls with this infantry. Pretty good one. This Parthia 191. Scorpion doing decent despite being split in half. And of course, uh, some of these camels. Or they're not camels. Some of these cataphracts. Doing some decent work. And then his ally titled some... Valerius 176, really good. These other ones got caught out outside. Um, not 100% sure what that was about, going outside with the slingers. I feel, I, still, you got to stay inside. Protect that ammo. Protect that ammo. Not enough armor on the front line to withstand the jabbies. I like the attempt, the aggressive push, and it was a good idea. But as we had mentioned already, the, the attackers, they were ready for it. They knew how to handle it, and they turned it around on them. But that's going to do it for today's battle, everybody. Until next time, take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Peace.